Tis the season for free template pleasing. What's good, Power Director peeps? It's your boy, Malik, back on your screen with more Power Director love from PowerDirectorUniversity.com. As we close in on December 25th, I want to wish everybody out there a happy holiday. And my gift to you will be some free Christmas templates from PD Template Zone. Not only does PD Template Zone provide you free Christmas templates, but they provide templates for all types of occasions, titles, and all types of scrumptious goodies. So you guys have been waiting long enough. Let me go ahead and show you just how to get those templates downloaded and how to find them in Power Director. Let's jump off into the PD Template Zone and make it happen. Here we are at the PD Template Zone. The link to the site has been placed in the video description for your convenience. Before we get started, I want to remind you to subscribe to Power Direct University to see great tips and tricks just like this every Saturday. And after you subscribe, you might as well click on the bell. When you click on the bell, you receive notifications every time I upload content to YouTube. That way you don't miss out on any of the learning and all of the fun. Let's step up our template game. Before you start grabbing all of the free goodies, you need to register for the site. So don't forget to head over to the registration tab and fill out all of the great things that you need to fill out to get registered. And after you're done registering with the site, you need to go over to the member login tab and log into the site. Once you do that, you can start handling your template business and downloading to your heart's content. If you scroll down on the right side of the page, you can see all of the templates that were recently added. So as you can see, there are some Christmas templates, uh, some titles, all kind of good stuff over here. And if you keep scrolling down, you'll see a plethora. I mean a plethora of template categories that you can choose from. Now, I'm going to leave it up to you and your imagination to explore all of these categories because Christmas is right around the corner and I figured that today we should concentrate on snatching up some tasty holiday morsels. So I'm going to scroll up here to the top and I'm going to go to the search box and I'm going to type in Christmas. And I'm going to hit enter. And we have three items to choose from. I'm going to select Power Director Xmas Slideshows. And here there are five. It says version 5.0, version 4, 3, 2, 1. There are five beautiful templates here that we could choose from. And then we even have a little extra one down here at the bottom to make it six. So there's actually six little templates we could choose from. Version five, four, three, two, one. And then the bonus template. Ooh, a bonus template. I don't know why I said that like that, but I did. All right. So just deal with it. I'm going to go ahead and choose slide version four. So here we have download PDX Xmas slides V4. So I'm going to click on that. And so as you can see on the bottom left hand side, it is downloading the item. So I'm going to go ahead and show this in the folder that it's in. Let me drag this over here for you guys and it's highlighted right here. Here's a zip folder. So I'm going to double click on this. And now we see the dot DZS file. This is the actual template and it will put it right into power director for us. So if we double click on this, it will be in power director for our usage. So I'm going to double click on it. Now the message here says the magic style template was successfully installed and is now ready to use. It's available for power director. Now the key is here. It says 
the magic style template. So I know that magic style templates are going to be located in the magic movie wizard. So that's why I'm going to go to look for it when I open up power director. So I'm going to click on okay. And now that we've downloaded the template, let's go to power director and use it. Here we are at power director 17 and I have some images in the media room that I want to use with the template that I just downloaded. So, I'm going to go up here to the plugin button. I'm going to left click on that and I'm going to go down to magic movie wizard because remember it got added to the magic style. So that means that I can access it in the magic movie wizard. So I'm going to left click on magic movie wizard and now it opens up the magic movie wizard and I need to pick where I want to grab my files from. And I said, I wanted to use the pictures that I have in the media room. So I'm going to pick media library. And I'm going to click on next. And now I need to find the template that I downloaded and I downloaded PD Xmas slides V4. So I'm going to scroll down here and here it is PD Xmas slides V4. So I can see the demo if I want to by clicking on this, but I'm just going to go ahead and click on the item to select it. So I'm going to click on settings and I'm going to show you a few things in here. So there's an option here for background music. Now there is already background music in most of these templates. So I wouldn't be too concerned about adding music to it because if you do, it's going to add it on top of the music that's already there, but I'm going to show you how to change the music in a second. Uh, you can choose whether you want to mix the audio level and the videos audio. So if there's audio in the video, you can pick, Hey, I just want to hear more of the audio with the video or more of the music that I have in the background. It's up to you. And then you can change the duration. Now here is a button that says advanced settings. So if I click on this, I can go ahead and change other criteria that are used, uh, scenes with zoom and pan, uh, scenes with people speaking. I can move these sliders to select all types of different things. And if you want to see more about this, you can watch my magic movie wizard tutorial to see more about this. I'm going to go ahead and click on okay. And I'm going to click on okay again. And now I'll click on next. And it goes ahead and puts the media in here exactly how uh, it was in the timeline or in the media room. So if I play, so if I press on play, you can see a preview of how it's going to look. So I'm going to just scrub the timeline. I don't want to play too much of the music because I don't know what the copyright thing is on here, but you can see all of the great ways that it put together a fantastic template. And I'll give you a demo of it with different music later on. So here you have reorder media. So if you didn't like the order of the media, how it ended up and right now it just took it just like it was in the media room and just added it, but I can move these around and reorder it if I want to. I'm going to go ahead and go back. And then if I want to go ahead and take out the music that was in the template and add my own music, I could click on edit in the theme designer. In here it has background music and it has default. So I can click on this and I can do no music or I can import music and I'm going to import some music. So I'm going to click on import it. And I'm going to use this music here and click on open. And now I'm good to go with the music. I was able to go ahead and take out the template music and add my own. So now I'm going to click on okay. And now I'm fine with playing the preview because I know that this is royalty free music and YouTube's not going to worry about it. And if they do, I got the right to use it. Okay, 
So that's just a quick sneak peek and I'll give you a little bit more to look at in a second, but I'm good to go here. So I'm going to go ahead and click on next. And now you have the option to produce the video. You can create a disc or you can go ahead and add it to your timeline and do advanced editing in the theme designer. I'm going to go ahead and select produce video. And it tells me that it's going to replace any tracks in the timeline. I'm okay with that. I want to click on OK. It's going to update the timeline by adding the Magic Movie uh, theme designer to the timeline. It's going to send me to the Produce tab in a second. And now I can go ahead and select my settings. I will select where I'm going to save it to. Click on save and click on start. And it will produce the movie for your enjoyment. And that's it people. Go check out the PD template zone. The link is in the video description. They have a bunch of great resources, templates, titles, all types of good stuff for you to use. And it's all free. All right, Power Director peeps, that's it. Now you know where to go to get those free Christmas templates from the PD Template Zone, and also where to go get templates for all of your projects that you have coming up. Now, if you have a tutorial request that you'd like us to make, don't forget to head over to the video description and complete our tutorial request form. And watch more of my content so that you learn all of the tips and tricks on how to create great videos using Power Director. Merry Christmas. Thanks for watching this video. We'll see you again soon.